Distribution of a vaccine, both the current Pfizer vaccine and the potential Moderna vaccine, which could be hours away, of course, is a very complex undertaking now being made even more complex thanks to the winter weather. Transportation correspondent Gio Benitez is now live at the Moderna Distribution Center in Olive Branch, Mississippi, to talk a little bit more about that. Uh, Gio, how do you see this unfolding or how does Moderna expect this to unfold given that they don't have the same temperature recommendations or requirements that um, the Pfizer vaccine does, but they still have both a complicated process ahead and potential for unpredictable weather? Yeah, Diane, you know, that distribution effort, that massive distribution effort is going to begin right here in the Memphis area. And we're standing in front of McKesson. This is the company that Moderna has hired to distribute the max vaccine. They're then going to get those vaccines and the supplies you need for the vaccines to UPS and FedEx to get them out across the country. They showed us last week those freezers that they're going to be using. Those are all uh, McKesson operated freezers for those vaccines. Now, we are talking about nearly six million doses of that that Moderna vaccine. Now, the plan is to begin distributing those doses next week to the nation's frontline workers, those healthcare workers, and nursing home residents. Now, Moderna does have a slight shipping advantage here in the Memphis area, and that's because the FedEx World Hub is here in the Memphis area also, just about 30 minutes away. That is the nation's, that is the North America's largest cargo facility. Uh, so the vaccine could get to move around very, very quickly once that process starts gets going there, Diane. And Gio, what do we know about delays caused by that snowstorm to the Pfizer vaccine distribution? Yeah, you know, we saw that uh, they were delayed. In fact, in New Jersey, New Jersey's Governor Phil Murphy said uh, that they did see some delays with getting those Pfizer vaccines uh, around the Northeast to some of those hospitals there in New Jersey. But he says they're still going to get those vaccines just a little bit later. And take a look at this because UPS issued a service alert, uh, and this was for general shipments. Weather conditions around our regional hub in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, caused a disruption to operations. As a result, some shipments may experience unavoidable delays. We know FedEx also had some issues as well, but we do not know how many doses of vaccine were actually affected by those delays, Don. All right. Lots of planning, but one thing we can't always account for is the weather. Gio Benitez at the Distribution Center for Moderna in Olive Branch, Mississippi. Thanks, Gio. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.